Well, as an old rancher once said, happy cows make for delicious milk, or beef for that matter. Yeah, but something that leads to unhappy cows are all those pesky critters around them. Mm -hmm. However, Lee Jones, assistant professor of beef production medicine at UGA, has some solutions for you. Hello, today we're going to be talking about flies and their effects on livestock. Horn flies, face flies, stable flies have a, have a significant impact on the health and, and comfort in livestock. And we're going to talk a little bit about the products that are available to producer to control flies in their cattle. Horn flies can feed 20 to 30 times on cattle and cause a significant amount of blood loss in, in livestock. One of the things that also the flies will do is transmit bacteria that causes pink eye in cattle. One of the things that we can do to control uh, flies in cattle is using ear tags. Ear tags have an insecticide embedded into the tag and we apply two ear tags, one in each ear uh, in, in cattle to help prevent or control flies. Some of the products that farmers can use to control flies in cattle are back rubbers and dust bags. These can be located around water troughs, uh, mineral feeders, any place where cattle will, will travel through frequently. Some other products include pour-ons and sprays. The problems with pour-ons and sprays is they have to be repeated every two to three weeks. Ear tags will last the entire season, uh, the fly season, the summer, summer season. We do put one in each ear in a cow, and then we want to make sure that we remove those at the end of the fly season because any residual insecticide could promote resistance in flies the following year. We also want to make sure that we rotate. Insecticides come in several different kinds and we want to make sure that next year I use a different kind of insecticide in my ear tag than I used this year. Researchers have shown that about 200 flies per cow is the economic threshold of, now it's difficult to to count flies on cattle. So you really have to look at an area and, and when the flies would cover basically a pie plate on the back of the cow, that's a good time to go ahead and initiate fly control in your herd. All of these products and applications are useful to help keep your animals healthy. We're gonna have more animal health tips on future sessions of the Georgia Farm Monitor.